Come on, dude. You gotta go potty. Come on, man. You're killing me. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. So last night, I took a visit to the freaking dog. So last night I had to visit the ER. And they found nothing wrong with me. You would think that would be a good thing, but the problem is, is that a few years back, I had a physical done with an old doctor and he found some weird abnormalities in my EKG. So that's the thing that does this for your heart or whatever. He set me up with an appointment to go see a cardiologist to do like a sonogram or something to figure out what's going on because he said that most likely in the future, I'll have some chest pains because of it. Well, I do, I have chest pains. It's weird, it's kind of on the left side. I guess your heart's kind of more in the middle left, but it's on the left side of my chest. Two nights ago, it actually got worse to the point where it was just like it's like a stabbing feeling like somebody just stabbing me so it terrified me honestly like the weird the weird thing is is like when I ride it doesn't bother me when I walk when I do anything all day long it's just randomly so last night the cardiologist came into the ER she was like there's nothing wrong with your heart they did blood work all that fun stuff and they didn't find anything but the reason why I did all that is because today's my last day in Tennessee I'm headed to California tomorrow morning, and I wanted to at least go see a doctor. I didn't know where to go, so I just went to the ER. I wanted to at least go see a doctor so they can tell me, you know, if I need to do whatever, whatever I need to do, I don't know. So I got it done, and I'm going to actually call a doctor today, a, the cardiologist, um, to do a follow-up. The problem is, is that I'll be gone for six weeks, so I can't do a follow-up until the new year when I get back from California. Which brings me to my next point. Not the California thing, but the heart thing. In the description down below, there's a link to my sister-in-law's crowdfunding uh, thing. She is actually, as of today, she's getting heart surgery. She's getting valve replacement done. And if you guys, I, I'm not asking anybody to donate. I, I just, if you guys could do anything, share that link with your friends on Facebook, on anywhere. Um, just at least share it because the more people that can see it, the more that she gets. She's, she's one of my favorite people in the world, man. There's a bunch of money that was raised already, which is amazing. All I'm asking you guys is to grab that link, share it. If you donate, you get a high five from me. Anyways, so sorry about all that rambling. Let's get back to it. Let me drink a little bit of coffee first. So today is going to be kind of boring maybe, I don't know. Um, the apartment is a freaking mess. Like, there's just stuff everywhere. We have all the dogs here. We also have the big pup. If you've ever, I don't know if you've ever met him before or not. His name is Cohen. He's the oldest in the family. So I got a lot of stuff to do today. I got to pack up for my trip because I left it all last minute, of course. That's also why I took the rest of the week off. So I got to pack up. I got to pack up my bike. I don't want to do that yet. I'm hoping to get a small session in today, but there's probably, it's probably not going to happen. You guys probably won't see me ride. I don't know. Just keep watching. You might, who knows? I forgot to tell you guys, man, I got a new MacBook. This thing is dope. So the reason why I got it is because my wife uses the old MacBook and I didn't want to leave her with nothing. So I bought myself a new one. It's awesome anyways, because I needed something to edit on that's way faster. That poor old computer right there, that thing, man, I paid a lot of money for it, but it's just, it's just not good enough anymore. It's great for what she does, sucks for what I do. So new MacBook is sweet. I went out and I bought a bunch of clothes because working for UPS means I have to get wear like khakis and stuff, which kind of sucks. So I bought a bunch of nice shirts as well, which is kind of cool. Bought some new underwear for the ladies. Am I right? Am I right? I got a bunch of stuff I gotta do today here. Like I said, I gotta pack. We gotta do some grocery shopping for her because the company I work for is actually paying for everything for me. So I don't have to do anything while I'm out there, which is awesome. I just have to worry about paying the bills back home, which is what she's gonna do actually. I also packed up my drone. If you guys don't know, I gotta do backpack. This thing is so sick. It holds all my camera gear. Got a big spot right here for whatever the heck else I wanna do. Like this backpack is so sick, man. If you guys didn't know, I love this thing. Please don't drop it on my car, please don't drop it on my car. Holy cow, 
I think something happened to Liz's bag here. I think my car spit out some oil or something from the tailpipe. Oh, what the heck is that? All right, so I got the front side clean. That doesn't matter. Let's see if I can work some magic. Man, E.T., what the heck are you doing here, man? Get out of here. All right, I am packed up. Got all my clothes, got all my hats, my shoes, and my PlayStation somewhere down here. Yep, yeah, there it is. I am a nerd, so yes, I am packing my PlayStation. Everything looks good. I need to go get a haircut done and go get some lunch. Yep, I gotta get a haircut done. Let's go get a haircut, man. Got a haircut, got lunch, and now, grocery store. So I decided to drive the Evo today because it's been a minute since I have driven it. Yeah, it's gonna be probably a couple months till I drive my car again. So I needed to drive it today. Guys, I almost forgot to tell you, I got my Jeep back. Ooh, it's looking good. That's where I got hit, if you guys remember. And they did a heck of a job, dude. Like, it matches perfectly. I don't know what they did, but they matched it to the T, man. Like, no joke, I stared at it for a while. Awesome job. All right, so all I have left to do today is pack up my bicycle, and I will be done. Let's see if I can do this quickly. You ready for it? Let's see here. Done. Holy cow. You guys have no idea how hard that was to do. Guys, that is gonna be it for the video today. I hope it was entertaining and I hope you guys enjoyed all those fun little edits and transitions and stuff. Maybe you learned something, I don't know. Hopefully you did. If you did, please consider subscribing to the channel. As of today, it's my last vlog in Tennessee. My next vlog is gonna be while I'm in California. So I hope you guys liked the video. Please hit the thumbs up button, smash it, whatever you wanna do. Don't break your screen when you do it. But subscribe, like, and I'm gonna hang out with the missus for the rest of the night. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace.